Welcome back to the WFAN Sports Radio. I'm your host, Jacob Lifshed. This is my two co-hosts, Ben Frick, Drew Milberg. Today we'll be talking about the best NFL free agents in this year's free agency. Ben? Um, I mean, I know we're, we're supposed to be talking about best, but honestly, i got to start with some of the worst overpays that I've seen this offseason. Uh, I'm going to start off with Trevor Lawrence. He does not deserve that kind of money. I'm just saying it blatantly. He is being paid entirely off of potential that he may or may not have. I don't think he can take a Jaguars team that's been mediocre and made a playoffs once to give $300, $300 million to almost $300 million to a quarterback who hasn't shown he can do much. I think I think for that Lawrence contract, though, you got to think of what he's going to be. He obviously has the potential. He's shown it in the past, and he was amazing to start the year, and then he got injured, and then he started doing worse. You can't hold that part of the season against him where he was injured. And maybe being paid the, mo- the most money as a quarterback is a little steep, but come five years when he is that top five quarterback, he's not even going to be a top ten quarterback at that point in money paid. So you got to think of it in the long term. Mm-hmm. Ben, what do you have to say? Um, I mean, I just disagree. I think that even with the rising contract, even with the rising uh, contracts, I think that if um, if Lawrence doesn't do what he is projected to do, and it basically all comes down if he, if he wins a championship in the next ten-ish years, the contract will be seen as a complete overpay. If he doesn't do what the Jaguars want him to do and then bring Jacksonville championship, he's going to be looked at one of the horrible overpays in NFL history. As with every contract, though, right? I mean, you say the same thing about Burrow and golf and all that, but I think it just comes down to you pay a quarterback that much money if you think they can bring you to mm-hmm. a Super Bowl. And I think, like, Lawrence, I think so. Burrow, I think so. And, like, some of the quarterbacks, like, golf, it's like, I don't know. So I think it just comes down to that, and however much, it doesn't really matter how much you deem worthy, that how much money you think they're worth. It's just if you think they can take you to that Super Bowl, and I think I think Lawrence can. And that's all we have for you today, the WFAN Sports Radio. I'm your host Jacob Wolfshay. This is my co-host Ben Frick. My other co-host Drew Moberg signing off.